is Callie with Gemmins. Welcome back to my channel. And today we are going to have a little bit more fun. We're going to open up 10 more pearls. Actually, I had some extra, so we're going to open up 11 pearls today. Wow. Let's see what we have in those packets. Now, we've already added, for those of you that are just joining us and don't know what we're doing, we are opening up pearls and we are creating bath bombs with them. So when you order the pearl bath bomb, you will have a little pearl in it and just kind of show you a sample of one. I was trying to bring up the real bright, bright pink one here because we're going to do pink today. There's that really pretty bright pink. So you'll get a pink one or a purple one. Here's a purple one. And then, oh, that one just went down my shirt. Hold on a second. And then, or there's like some white ones that are bigger and uh, these will show up in bath bombs. I don't have a sample bath bomb right here. I've got mine are over there resting because I made some more for people. <clears throat> but anyway, uh, so we are opening up pearls to add to our bath bombs and it is called the pearl bath bomb. And we have as now, now we have a signature scent. So when you order your bath bombs, you will be getting this beautiful, um, it's kind of a sea greenish blue bath bomb color. And it has a emerald, it has a emerald sea, um, scent to it. So it's, it's a, it, it, per, it goes, it pairs perfectly with these pearl bath bombs. So if you're interested in those, those are on, those are going to be showing up on the website soon. I'll, I will do a demo here. I just got the, I've got the oil in and we're going to show you how we make those here in just a little while. So keep a watch for that video. All right, so let's get to it. Let's turn this down and we'll start opening up these 11 pearls. Let's see what we get today. So we are all ready to go. Let's open these. I will try and save the shells here again on this one the best I can. Sometimes I can't always do that, but I do try. And um, oops, like that because they break. These shells, these freshwater pearl shells are very, very delicate. They're not like the oyster, the saltwater pearl shells that have a harder side to them. Ooh, ooh, this is kind of a yellow. All right, so kind of a whitish yellow. I'm wearing gloves today. My hands are really hurting, so I decided to put these gloves on. Not quite sure what's going on with my skin today. Uh, it's clearly, there's nothing in there. Okay, so we're going to put that aside. So I'm wearing gloves today just to protect my hands. All right, so let's see what size of pearl we have today. And I'm not going to measure both sides. I'm just going to measure the one. The I'm going to measure it on the long side, just so you guys know. Okay, so 1070. Whoops, it fell back in the water. Let's do that in. I didn't get it tightened up. Tighten up. All right. Tighten that up a little bit. There we go. There you go, 985 on our first pearl this morning. That's starting out with a good one. And just I'll just measure the sides so you guys know what they are. They range between 7 and 8. So this one's, I can get it to grip. Okay, so this is 7.78 right there. Sometimes it'll switch when I turn it around. So if I say a different number, I apologize. Um, sometimes I don't have control over that. So that's our first pearl. Let's open up this little one. All right. Oh, that one opened up really easily. Oh, there's another really pretty one. There we go. Lay it out so I can get some smaller ones this time. Not too small. This is a 978, thereabouts. There you go. Put that in our sand down there. If you can see that, there's no duplicate in there. All right, let's open up our next one. sometimes just don't want to open okay so there's no duplicate in there just the one let that sit in there for a minute 
And we are washing our pearl with fresh water. This is distilled water, just so you guys know. And this measurement, oops, knocked that over there. Typical me. 9.8079. It's kind of it's kind of fluctuating there, so there you go. Not quite in there. Let's see if I can get a better grip on it. Okay, 9.98 is what it says on my caliber, but it could be a little bit differently. So there we go. Move that back over a little bit. All right, let's open another one. Just a shout out to everybody who purchased all those um, all the pearls so far. I want to say thank you so much for your support. Um, but we do have some other items on there, so don't let don't let you forget. We do have bath bombs and shower steamers, and um, we have uh, new aromatherapy products. If they're not up on the sh on the website by the time you see this, they are coming, which is really exciting. They're really beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, scents. So if you're looking for some more aromatherapy products, they're on there. Um, I had said earlier that I was going to fill off. I said earlier that I was going to drop my, my fragrance oils, but somebody asked me to keep them going because they like them. So we're going to definitely do that. Let me see if I can get a better grip on this one. Ah! And it fell down into my box. Tumble. I'm not sure where it went. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Thank goodness I had that box under there. Okay, let's clean this off again. Let's see if we can get a better grip on this one. There it is. It went up to 10.25. So, really beautiful pearl. You can see these pearls are kind of oval. I mean, are oval shaped. They're not round. Uh, the last bat, last couple batches we did were um, there was a couple round ones in there that were really pretty. But they were really small. So you could get one of those. You could get one of these. Um, who knows what you're gonna get? That one. Not sure. I'll one looks really, really dirty. I'm going to have to scrub this one up. I'm not sure if that's the way it is, if there's something on there. I'll have to really take a look at that one. That one is looks like it might be a damaged pearl. I may not be able to use that one. Let me see what size it is. It's really tiny too, so I may just pull this one out of the system. 10.16, but as you can see, it has some really weird discoloration on it. Okay, I'm going to put this in here, but I think I need to scrub this one down a little bit and get that cleaned up. Oh, look at how that one blewed up. It's so funny. Once they come out of their shells, their true colors come out after a while. It's so pretty. So, let's see. So they're ranging from real light color Pinks and whites and blues. Oh, there's a big one there. Beautiful shell. Okay. I need to go get a new towel. All right. That one's really nice. Uh, French water pearls are never perfect, just so you know. They're not a saltwater pearl, which has a little bit more control. They do come out with these all different little shapes. These are, it's a 10.68. There, isn't that pretty? So just be aware of that. There's going to be imperfections in the fresh waters, which I absolutely love. But that one I'm not really sure of. I may go ahead and pull that one from the mix and just leave it out. Or maybe I'll add it in as a twin somewhere and just give it away for free. I may do that. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna let it sit out in the air for a little bit and see how it, what the how it turns out. Oh, 
Ooh, ooh, wow. <laughs> Look at that pretty unusual pearl. See, this is what I'm talking about, them being different shapes and different colors. This is kind of a unique. See how that point is? This looks like a, a complete, like a water drop. This looks like a water drop. Okay, so let's see what the measurement is on this, if I can get it because of that point. Okay, 11.10 on the long side. You see that? Isn't that pretty? Wow. That is, that is a perfect water drop. That is so pretty. I'll lay it down so you guys can see that. Can you see how pretty that is? Oh, that's a glove. See how pretty that is? It's kind of an orange. It's looking like it's an orange, like a tropical orange. Okay, so how many pearls do we have? So there we have three, four, five, six, seven. So a seven, eight. <clears throat> I haven't been counting here. Oh, hey, another pretty pearl. All right, so that one's really pretty. Let's see what this measurement is. This is kind of a, it's got a little bit of a yellow tint to it, kind of an ivory. 10.15 on the long side. So there you go. Put that in there too. Number 10. Let's see, there's another one. Ooh, that one cracked. <laughs> you can't see it completely broke on this side. That's what I'm saying about these freshwater pearls. Sometimes they just don't want to open properly. All right, there. I was able to dig that one out a little bit. Ah, there's the pearl, and there is definitely nothing else in there. Ooh, not too bad. Okay. Whoops. Come back here. Wash that up. We will add these into the new little mix of baggies behind us and we'll get some really pretty. One of you guys will get some of these really pretty pearls. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and let me know which ones you get. We'd love to hear back from you. So there you go. There's that measurement. 10.12. That one there. Because these are really beautiful. And uh, I make them up 10, 11 at a time. And then uh, we sell those out. And then we make some more. Uh, just so you guys know, I make them in, I make the bath bombs in small batches. And the reason for that is, is um, it actually goes, ooh, wow, that's a big one. I got to measure that one on both sides. Okay, there's, so there's nothing in that one. That's a bit, I think that's the fattest one we've had so far. That is gorgeous. It's kind of got a yellow hint to it. So let's measure it on both sides. So the long, the short side is 8.53. That's on the short side. Okay, so let's go on the long side. And I think this is the biggest, fattest one we've had. To, well, it definitely is today. Oop, I can't get it to measure out here. Let me lay it down on here and get a better grip. 10.88 is what that ended up being, or 8.7. It's fluctuating, so. Wow, 8.9. See, that's what it, it's going to a different one. Isn't that gorgeous? It's got a little bit of yellow to it. Get that in there. Yeah, I'm really not liking that pearl. I think what I'll do is I'll do it. I'll put that one in a double and we'll give, just give that one away since it's not a perfect, it's not, it's well, freshwater pearls are never perfect, but I mean, it's not, it's not one that I would want to put into a pearl to sell. So we'll just, I'll pop it in someone's bag somewhere, maybe in a soap or something. I'll surprise you with a couple of pearls. Okay. That just dropped out. Okay. And so, so there's nothing in that meat. It's just a nice thick piece of meat. And this is our number 11. This is our last pearl. So let's see what this measurement is. This is kind of a pretty one. It's kind of got it like a pearl-esque um, size to it. So on the short side, it's 8.24. 
can see that. And on the long side, let's see if I can lay it down, be easier. Another egg shape. I like these egg shaped ones, they're really pretty. But that's typical, 9.68, so this is the smaller one of our group, so there you go. Isn't that pretty? All right, so there you have it, you guys. There are our pearls, and that one is really damaged right here, so I'm gonna put this just in as a freebie um, for someone. So if you order one of our pearls, we'll throw that one in as a freebie. So you'll get an extra little pearl. And then um, I see if I can clean it up, but I don't know that I can. It looks like it's that's just the flaw in it is all. So, all right. So there you go. There's our next mix of pearls going in our pearl bombs. So <clears throat> look for those on the website. They are The scent now is going to be a emerald sea grass. It's actually, that's what the name of it is. But it's, a, it's, an, it's an emerald sea and I absolutely love the flavor or the scent of it. It's very soft. It's very subtle. It's very sea-ish. It's, it's like you were, you know, walking down um, a, a, a beat in a beach um, by the sea. It's, it's beautiful. And it will come with a little bit of a teal um, coloring to it. Uh, let's see if I can. I made one once, uh, one, but it, the, oh, it's right here. Okay. So this is what your bath bombs will look like. Can you see that? This is a half bomb. This is my demo. So your pearls will come in a bath bomb that looks like this. And it's a signature scent. Only I will have this scent. And it is a sea scent. And it's very, it's a soft, not floral. I, I can't really describe it, it, but it's got a really beautiful scent. And if I can find the description of it, I'll definitely put it down below. Otherwise, I'll put my own description on there and... Um, You'll see it. So anyway, so there you go. There's our pearls. Let me put these up one more time for you guys. Look at those beautiful pearls that you got. Those are coming to you. One of them will be come to you and we'll put that one flaw one, this one right here. See that one right there. We'll put that one um, in a in a bag and we'll give that one away just because it's a really bad flawed pearl and uh, we'll just we'll just give it away. Uh, I'll put it in a twinsy for you. All right. So there you go. Thanks, everybody, for joining me today. Thank you for opening up some pearls with me. We're Keep watching. We're going to release some more here in the next couple weeks. Don't forget to go on and purchase those, um, those pearl uh, oysters. Uh, they're price pointed at $19.99 um, because I, we do have some of the larger ones and smaller ones, so we're mixing them up a little bit. And uh, let me know which pearl you get. Take a picture of it. Throw it up on the site here. And uh, we'll see if we can give a shout out to everybody who purchases those. So everyone who has purchased those products, I don't have the list here with me, but I want to say thank you so much for purchasing our pearl bombs. And we are just having a fantastic time having fun with these. And we do have other products on the website. I'm getting ready to go into my essential oil, um, making some new soaps and stuff. So watch for those videos too, because they're coming out real soon also, including my men's my men's line and my kids' soaps, those are coming out too. We do have baby soaps coming out. Um, they're only available right now at the farmer's markets because I'm trying to test the products out to see how well they go. My moms are really loving them, so we're going to bring them up and put them on the website here soon. So there you go. That's enough for me. <laughs> Whew! What a morning! <laughs> Got some fantastic pearls and some other things happening. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for joining me. Have a really beautiful day. Bye!